Today is Thursday, May 9th, and this is Tommy Media's News in 90. I'm Sabrina Thompson. The Rafah border crossing with Egypt has been closed since Israel's military took control of the Palestinian side early Tuesday, blocking the entry of desperately needed humanitarian aid. The UN says northern Gaza is already in a state of, quote, full-blown famine. The first shipment of humanitarian aid to a floating pier off Gaza has left a port in Cyprus. The Cyprus foreign minister said the U.S. vessel departed to transfer as much aid as possible to Gaza by sea. Forecasters warned a wave of dangerous storms in the U.S. could march through parts of the south early Thursday after storms a day earlier spawned damaging tornadoes and massive hail, leaving two dead in Tennessee and one dead in North Carolina. Deputies responding to a disturbance call at a Florida apartment complex burst into the wrong unit and fatally shot a black U.S. Air Force airman. An attorney for the man's family said Wednesday, The family will join civil rights attorney Ben Crump for a news conference Thursday calling for transparency in the investigation. After Minnesota state legislators and Minneapolis council members announced a compromise on wage legislation for Uber and Lyft drivers, the companies are threatening to leave Minnesota entirely. For TommyMedia.com, I'm Sabrina Thompson.